CarToys.com. Friends, I'm at Costco. You see all that line behind me? All that line. I mean, I've been waiting to get gas for like maybe just maybe nine minutes or ten minutes. But when I came in here, all every single one of these pumps, and there's one, two, three, four, five, five pumps times three, fifteen. They're all taken and the the car line is all the way to the road where it's blocking the traffic coming in because of coronavirus. Everybody is panicking, everybody's scared. So I'm scared to go inside Costco. <laughs> Costco friends, it was not a good one. It was not a good trip. Like the shelves were empty, anything perishable, water, toilet paper, everybody was buying toilet paper. And then hubby goes, babe, we just bought toilet paper. I go, I'm buying one. <laughs> there may not be toilet paper and toilet paper is a necessity. So here's what I got. I wasn't expecting to purchase all this in Jonathan's little Batmobile, but at least I got the kids Lego my egos because Legos my egos is important. But I got two water. We are now, oh, and then um, there, this was on sale. Mac and cheese for Danica, some, chicken chicken and then of course hubby says i need necessities i need my is it kumbacha so i bought two of those and then ramen so okay so we got ramen <laughs> this is how the car looks look at this look at this <laughs> it's ridiculous but hey if everybody else is doing it i better do it too because they may know something that I don't. Let me just talk with you guys for a um, little bit. Because <clears throat> the reason I went to Costco was one, I needed gas. So I was down to like one bar for Jonathan because Jonathan was driving around yesterday. And then um, I needed, what did I need? I think I needed mac and cheese. Well, I needed something for, oh no, you know what? Because um, I haven't had a chance to go to the commissary. So I needed like meat, like, you know, ground beef. So I ended up buying ground beef over at Costco. And then getting there, ga the gas line was so long, everybody was getting gas. As if there's like a hurricane and, you know, we're on a emergency, you know, we got to get out of here kind of thing. Blocking the, the roadways to go into Costco. Then inside Costco, well, I couldn't find parking. Took me like 10 minutes to find parking. And then inside Costco, like as I'm walking around and driving around looking for a spot, I'm like, why does everybody have like toilet paper? It's like one cart had five toilet paper. <laughs> and then like water. I'm like, okay, people are panicking. Hmm. Maybe I should get water too. <laughs> okay. Hubby just bought toilet paper, Costco toilet paper, in fact, the other day. And then I go, babe, I think we need toilet paper. He's like, no, we don't. We're good. I go, hmm. I went to the toilet paper section because I thought that's where the water was. And there was a worker in there, like, limiting of how many toilet papers that they can give. Um, because they're like, well, he wasn't, like, limiting. I'm sorry. He wasn't limiting. But he was the one picking up the stuff. And then like so it wasn't chaotic because there was a whole bunch of people around also in the water that's when you know shit does hit the fan mm -hmm. about to hit the fan so let's not panic stay calm Diane so I bought ramen when we have enough ramen I had box of mac and cheese I have toilet paper we can always use it later on. I have two water and they, they ran out of the other drinking water. They just have purified, which I'm fine with. So I should have grabbed three because two may not be enough. Um, and they were only $2.99, but I couldn't push the cart. <laughs> I was putting the third one in there and it was so hard for me to push. And then I, that was like the second stuff I, I got because the first one was the toilet paper. And I'm like, I had to put it back and I couldn't push the cart. So if we run out of water, it's because I couldn't push the cart. I'm sorry, family. <laughs> Anywho, um, I don't know. Like, I understand people panicking. Um, just be diligent. Wash your hands. Wash hands, friends. Wash your hands. Don't be around people that are 
coughing. Um, stay indoors if you can. I'm worried about the kids at school. Uh, we are here in the Pacific Northwest in Seattle and the first death in the US is here. So you would understand why I and I have four kids and they range from babies to adult. <laughs> I'm kind of scared right now. I'm like kind of scared right now. Like I don't want to be out in public. I just want everybody to stay home. Like I don't want to panic. I don't want to panic. I don't need to panic, but let's just all stay home. Okay? I think you know, everything will be okay, but let's just stay home because I'm scared to go anywhere. There's a, a student, I think high schooler, that... A high schooler that um, caught... He tested positive for coronavirus. He had no families that went overseas. He made no contact with anybody that went overseas, but you don't know. Like you could be at the grocery store or like I did at Costco where there was a whole bunch of people and I don't know who was sick and who's positive for coronavirus, but I could have it. And that's what everybody's thinking. Everything will be all right. If I go to, I was thinking this, I'm so sorry, I, I'm so, not all there i'm like going into the tanning because I, I i went to the um the gym and there's a tanning like i only can do the stand up i can't do the laying down because you guys know i have issues with my ocd um i have germ issues so this coronavirus is like really working me up because if you already have a germ phobia this is not a good time oh what do I need? I always ask hubby, like, when I'm, when, when, when it's like this, what do I need? And then he goes, you need a glass of wine. I go, a glass is not enough. I need a bottle. Calm my nerves down. But, um, we were at the gym and there's a tanning salon and I do the stand up one and then the heat, the UV rays. And I'm like, I wonder if this will kill the, the virus, the coronavirus. But then I'm like, doesn't cold kill it? Not heat? Well, too much heat because it's, I don't know. I'm like, will this heat kill the virus? Should I have all these kids, all my kids go <laughs> stand up into the... I, I'm not thinking straight. I'm just joking, friends. But that really, literally just went through my head. Like, did I just... Would this kill the virus? This is what happens when people panic. They think of crazy stuff. Anywho, um, busy day for me today i got work so lots of lots of lots of uh stuff to do at work and then i uploaded my video of what's in my work bag and i love that work bag it's the gm um louis vuitton never full i did not film yesterday but we hubby and i went to louis vuitton to get my um my planner heat stamp and then he was also going to get his wallet heat stamp. But he said he'll just do that next time. So it'll take about three to five days for that. And then I just put D.M. Because then I can give it to my girls. Because my girls are also D.M. Which is nice. And then J J Hubby goes, I can get mine heat stamp too. Because then I can give it to Jonathan. Because the boys are G.M. The girls are D.M. So that was pretty funny. But uh, friends, just be careful. Be careful of this virus because everybody is in a panic. I mean, like if we run out of gas, like it, I'm just looking at it as if like there's a hurricane. There's a natural disaster. So get gas, get perishables, you know, enough that will last you about a week, two weeks. But don't over, don't over panic it. Just be diligent, be careful, wash hands, uh, stay away from con like convention. Hubby and Jonathan are going to Emerald Con Convention. I told Hubby, you better cancel that. He goes, well, there's no cap. I don't care if you lose out on that money. I don't think you boys should be going. Because let's face it. Those those con conventions that they like to go to. I go, people fly from all over the world. And people don't shower. It's a three or four day event. And they don't shower. <laughs> That's why I don't go. Not all of them. My boys shower. <laughs> and some some of them shower but there's some that don't so i'm like 
and then, go, and then hubby goes you're right they are flying from all over the world yes hubby it is time not to do those kind of things right now like conventions like disneyland he goes maybe for danica we can you know we can go to disneyland because she's kind of disneyland with all these people hubby come on <laughs> he's like babe do you want a glass of wine <laughs> when we were discussing this last night I go yes please make it a big one <laughs> we got our acai bowl, so we gotta grab some of that, find some of the butternut squash, pasta, so this pasta doesn't have the pasta, and then our favorite three dinners, and then our canvas. <laughs> we are stocking up. And then cheese, and then this one, and then hummus. So you got our meat. Okay? Tell you, friends, you gotta stock up. Oh, and then tofu. Ooh, okay. I just realized. I said, Danielle, where are we gonna fit all this? I don't know. <laughs> uh, Jonathan's car is pretty filled up, and it's a little bitty Batmobile. Uh, uh, I'll help you. I'll help <laughs> barely. You. Oh my gosh, it's a hot mess today. Like even this Trader Joe's, like it wasn't a major line, but he was saying like, yeah, it's been crazy for the past four days. So I'm just glad that I stocked up because I needed food anyways. Um, and it's not too crazy, but you know, you need water, you need toilet paper, cup of noodles. Never go wrong with cup of noodles. <laughs> Mahalo, friends. I'll see you guys in a bit. And what is it now? It's hailing. You guys see that? It's snow. There it is. I thought it was snow at first. Uh, yeah, I thought snow. it was snow. Like, no, babe, that's hail. Oh, wow. Oh my gosh, babe. This is so weird. Is that why all of a sudden there's like traffic? Yeah. Oh, that's um, is that heavy rain now? Oh, that's Washington for you. Pacific Northwest. Oh no, it's hailing. Oh. Oh wow. Yeah, I remember I was saying we're driving up, I'm like, Look at this big, look at the big rain, you know, look at the yeah. big rain cloud, and you're like, is that a rain cloud? I'm like, yes, it is a rain cloud, babe. It's pretty dark. <laughs> well, apparently it's not a rain cloud, it's a hail cloud. Yeah. And look, it's sunny over there, so it's only this patch over here. All right, we are on our way to go to the gym. Ooh. Okay, so at the gym, I had an impulse buying moment, because there's a um, tanning. So I bought this one because it says it's also good for tattoos. $59! And then when we went home, I looked at um, Amazon because I thought we stopped at Ulta first. I thought Ulta would have it, but only Ulta Online sells it. And Amazon sells it for what, $19.99? Yeah, same bottle, same thing. Same thing! $19.99. $19.99, and they're selling it for uh, almost $60. That's a ripoff! That's three times, 300%. Yeah. Oh, uh, got me water. I need to try some of that. This one? Or uh, something similar. Yeah, I bought one. Juice. I bought one, um, it's a dark one, Amazon. We're, we'll get it delivered on Tuesday. Tuesday. Oh my goodness, friends, stop. I'm gonna tell Babe to work my way the rest of my hours. I'll just work her all day Wednesday. Always raining. Always raining here in the Pacific Northwest. Should we catch hubby? What you doing, hubby? I have like a loose hair. You ever have a loose <laughs> hair in your nose and it's just like... <laughs> and you're just like... Yes. And you just keep rubbing your nose. And to like other people, it seems like you're picking your nose all the time. But, but you're it, not. You're, you're just dealing with a loose hair. And you're like, oh my gosh, just <laughs> go away. Yeah, I can see hubby in the corner of my eye. I'm like, what you doing? I cut you. <laughs> <laughs> uh, all right, so it stopped. Can we watch a movie? You have to work. Should we watch a movie? 